and welcome to another edition of GMG News. Today we're unboxing Lara Croft and the Temple of Osiris, the Gold Edition. This is a game made by Square Inked. If I said that wrong, I'm very sorry. Um, also developed by Crystal Dynamics. It is a 12 and it is for the PlayStation 4. And like I said, this is the Gold Edition, so let's get straight into this. Comes in this little box itself. Bought this for fifteen pound from Game in London, so it should be the same price everywhere. Okay, this is the surf. This is the top. Side view. Side view again. Turn it up. Side view again. And this is the back. Now, what do we get? Art book featuring never before seen concept art. That's pretty cool. You get a map of the overworld, which I take is the map of the game itself. You get a season pass that includes the season pass includes the icy death and the twisted gears pack, which offers six additional costumes and will challenge Lara, Carter, Horus, and Isis to conquer additional tombs and collect treasure troves of unique rings, amulets, and weapons. And you also get a limited edition mini Lara statue, which is pretty cool, I guess. Um, this is like the Rise of Tomb Raider series. This like this series was made to be more kid friendly because um, obviously it's a twelve, you know. And the new Rise of the Tomb Raider, I think that's actually an eighteen. All right. I like the box itself. It's in this whole cardboard box itself. It's very cool. All right, let's just figure out how to turn up this up. But this game is supposed to be rated one of the best for a cooperative play. Yeah, it's up to four players. So this is more of a game that you would play with friends instead of by yourself. Right. As you see it opens up, this is the box itself. Once you open it up, you get the game inside. Which is Epic four player adventure in Egypt as Laura and her companions fight the way across the sands and through ancient tombs they will face gods, monsters and myths and legends with the fate of the world at stake. Lara must uncover the fragments of Osiris to stop Set from enslaving all mankind. Set, that's a bit of a weird name for a, uh, for a bad guy but there you go. Right, one to four players. Two to four players online. You need 30 gig of memory to play this game. You need a DualShock controller. Uh, it just tells you the video output itself, 720, 1080 HP, Re supports remote play, um, features bad language and violence, online play also featured itself, uh, defeat hordes of enemies and solve deadly puzzles, discover powerful weapons, artifacts to give to your team, dominate dominating powers, compete against your friends with seamless drop in and drop out co-play, so oh, that's quite cool, so your friends can drop in and drop out so you don't have to necessarily have someone with you all the time, you could start a level with three of you and end up with just one of you. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, what else we get inside? So, inside we get this book. Some of the artwork we get inside. Pretty cool. And this is apparently never before seen artwork. But the thing is, that looks like the Tomb Raider out of the newer Tomb Raider but it is the same company so I guess they would share ideas yeah nice feel to it the back and little Tomb Raider figure <laughs> pretty cool might keep that that too side and the scroll. I'm not actually going to open this up but this scroll itself is the map of Lara Croft of Cyrus. So there you go guys that was the unboxing of Lara Croft and the Temple of Osiris. Um, I might actually give this away so stay tuned and have a good day.